Um, the short answer is yes, it, it is happening. I think the um, the time has clearly come now, sort of whatever we are now, five, six years after the peak when uh, at that point a number of investors, not just French, also started to go beyond their domestic markets for direct deals. Um, and you know that that certainly has has taken quite a lot of pain over the last few years. But um, what, what's so so in some ways often what one's seen in the past is institutions can sometimes take ten or fifteen years to go back and make the same mistake again. Now I don't think that's what's happening here. I think what is happening is that the the there is um, a much more cautious approach to investment and. What, what people are generally realizing is that the diversification is becoming a much more important feature of their portfolio. So rather than just investing in my home market, and where's the logic in that? These same insurance companies and pension funds, when they look at equities and bonds, they don't see, they don't see boundaries, they don't see um, you know, different, different languages, different cultures. But on the real estate side, there has always been a, a, a resistance to that. And I think that is what's starting to erode now as they recognize that they need to diversify, otherwise they risk exposing themselves uh, by having just exposure all in one country. And so a number of, of our clients, and some of those, yes, definitely French, are looking to achieve diversification. And um, their first port of call, even though I said that in general the UK might be the number one market for most coming out of you know, the International Investment Forum, um, for certainly, say, French investors, Germany becomes much more obvious for currency reasons. So okay. very much so, yeah. Good, thank you. Yes, uh, I mean, I mean, uh, we we are lucky guys in Germany these days. Um, uh, that's for sure. Uh, we we still have uh, uh, potential as long as the interest rates are remaining that low. Um, we we still have potential in in a couple of locations in the super core uh, market, as as you uh, have seen before. Uh, Andreas showed the slide. Um, only in two cities uh, these days we have um, uh, yields of below 5%. Um, uh, so there are a couple of cities where there is still potential um, in, in this uh, uh, core uh, sector for sure. Um, and, and we are seeing uh, uh, not only money uh, uh, from, 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 from the French for sure, uh, but, but all over the world. Uh, and I would, I would reckon that the portion in the next two years um, from from 30 percent uh, these days uh, will uh, go up to 40 to 50 percent for sure.